do y'all not know what dating both genders at two different times because i don't date both at the same time period but do y'all not know what dating two different genders mean like you just like both i was having conversations online with my supporters and stuff like that and i was like you know i'm gonna make a song about this like i'm so tired of hearing the same thing how can you be bi why are you bi uh, i just sent him the link i swear to god i just sent him the link there you go The response of this song was so good. I was not expecting it. I'm like, okay, like, whoa. Like I was overwhelmed um, because I see a lot of people say like, oh my gosh, I came out to my mom with this song. I don't know how you came out to your mom with this song because you talking about you like dick and pussy at the same time. I don't know what kind of parents y'all got, but. <laughs> Uh, and a lot of people want me to perform this at Prize and stuff like that. And I'm just like, oh my God, I should have released it sooner. But um, the response has been great. I like girls. I like guys. I like to eat the pussy. Then again, I like to ride. Yeah, I love kissing no girls. I then I put the dick inside. I'm bisexual, bitch, and I ain't got nothing in the hide. I finally felt like I just have nothing to hide and I just don't care when um, the end of 2018, while I was going through this big stage in my life of becoming who I really am. And I'm just like, I don't care. I'd rather people like me for who I really am than to dislike me for who they think I am. Yeah, these bitches hating on me cause I'm confident in me. Better not forget the B and LGBT. I think it's important to remind people that it's a B and LGBT because people forget about it so much. People look at you sideways when you say I'm bisexual. They're like, you would be surprised at how many people get confused at simple B, like the B. Like bisexual, like, like I was like, if I'm talking to a girl, they're like, oh, so you're gay. Or if I'm talking to a guy, they're like, oh, you're straight now. Like I'm the B in LGBT and there's a whole bunch of B's in this bitch. So let's get it together. And y'all like to say we selfish and y'all say we like to cheat, but I don't, they both at the same time, haters have a seat. People just always assume that bisexuals are cheaters, bisexuals are selfish, bisexuals cannot be with one gender and be satisfied, which is false. If I am with you, I am with you. If I'm taking dick at the time, then I'm just taking dick for the rest of my life. If I'm taking pussy at the time and we're like, hey, we're going strong, we're gonna make this work, then guess what? We're scissoring, period. I like girls, oh my gosh, big booty, big tits. I like guys too, though, super sexy, big dick. And if you're hating on me, ho, then I'm down, big shit. And if you're curious, I got you, baby girl, quick fix. I think if anybody is curious, do it. Find somebody you trust. Have a one night stand, I promote that. Be safe though, don't just be doing anything. You don't just be herpes going around. Actually, I don't, don't kiss, I'm, that's stupid. Actually, <laughs> just do it. Like, I feel like my whole life I've not been sexual, which this song is like kind of like, dang, coming out the closet, let's get dirty, you know? So I feel like I haven't really experimented either, but I feel like the goal is to. So just experiment. If girls, you're like, hey, I don't know if I like girls. Touch a vagina. Or boys, I might like dick, I might not. Touch it. You never know, you might get, you know? You never know. How the fuck you date a guy when you're bi? You a fake ass dyke, I don't like you, I won't lie. You cannot date both, pick a side, pick a side. Do you like fucking girls or do you like fucking guys? Some of the criticisms that I've got is you're a fake ass dyke. Oh, <laughs> the famous one, you make lesbians look bad. <laughs> I do not represent anybody but myself, okay? You know what I'm saying? I tr I'm trying to, you know, give a representation for the bees, but I'm not like a whole group of people. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm one person. You know, I got Dom on Dominique, Alter Ego, Hannah Montana, Miley Cyrus, but other than that, like, do not put me in that category like I'm, rep like I'm the president of the United States. No, like you represent yourself, I represent me, period. I like both. Bop pride, stand up, I like a girly little thing, and I do man up. My preference in a girl, we're gonna start with the girls first, is I like feminine women. I'm not against masculine women. I've just never really dated like a masculine woman for real because I just like tight clothes. I like the feminine of it. Like, I don't know. I feel like masculine women are very beautiful. They're still women. There's nothing wrong with them. It's just everybody has a preference. I thought I liked, you know, muscular dudes who, I think I like them teddy bear. Rick Ross. You know what I'm saying? I'm a little big, you know? I've never talked to a big dude before. I'm not against it. Hit my DMs. I'm not against it though. <laughs> Walking to the strip club and then I throw my bands up and when he give me sloppy top, he like to throw my hands up. I mean, I barely go to the strip club, but when I do hit the strip club once a year annually, you know, I'm not throwing millions of dollars, thousands of dollars 
I do go into the rooms where they, you know, give you a little private session. I'm not gonna tell you how much that costs, but anyways, oh, <laughs> my lyric when I say, when he gave me sloppy toppy, I mean, sometimes you gotta put your hands up. You you, you can't be touching all on, all on the head, it gets distracted, and they be like, uh, uh, and then you gotta be like, okay. If I wanna date a girl and we don't work out, then it's cool, sexuality is fluid. It's okay to date a dude. And if I date a fucking guy and we break up, it's okay to date a pretty girl, ain't no fake love. When I mean by sexuality is fluid, is sexuality changes so much. People think like, oh, if I came out when I was like seven years old as gay, I'm gay for the rest of my life. I can't change. Sexuality changes so fluently. I am not against dating um, men, women, transgenders, whatever. Like, I feel like if we vibe, I'm into you. I met a cute little shorty way back in 08. I was really in denial. I was like, no way. I met a dude up in high school. I was so confused. How the fuck do I like girls? Then I started liking dudes. <sighs> I remember her like it was yesterday. Um, we touched a little bit. We never kissed. It was kind of like a, I don't know if I can say this, kind of like a dry hump with clothes on. And I was like, wow, I think this is, we're meant to be. We weren't. And then in high school, so I'm like, okay, I'm gay at this point, but I was in eighth grade, you know what I'm saying? I'm still figuring stuff out. Um, and then in high school, I was like, yo, I'll start talking to this dude. We never did anything, but like we kissed and stuff, little adolescent stuff. Uh, and I was like, wow, like I'm feeling this. Like, how can I like both? Cause nobody really told me about bisexuals. I just knew like, I thought you had to like one gender. I'm like, I have to pick. God put all these beautiful people on the earth and he wants me to choose a side. At this point it's getting difficult. And I realized, ain't no rules to this shit. Ain't a crime to like pussy. Ain't a crime to like dick. Ain't a crime to be whoever, whenever. Man, I'm sick. I'm a bi girl, bitch. Little fly girl, bitch. B I to the S E X U A. It's a L if you hate, you know me, bitch. I slay. No, I am not gay. And no, I am not straight. I'm no B in this bitch. Bop pride all day. I just stopped caring altogether. I used to care so much what people thought about me, and that would make me so unhappy. And I think the moment that I just stopped caring in general, I just became happy, I became self, like, free. Yeah, I'm bi, I'm bi, and I like them both, I got pride. Yeah, I'm bi, I'm bi. I'm the B in this, you know why, yeah. yeah. You would never think, like, why do you care so much about what I'm doing with my life, who I'm sleeping with, who I'm kissing? Mind your business. It's usually the people who are secretly in the closet who be homophobic. You would not believe, like the people who fight anti-gay bills or you can't, I'm gonna not let you in my restaurant because you're of the LGBT, them be the people you gotta watch out for. You probably sucking dick behind the door. You don't, like, it be those people, I promise you. Um, I used to dress like masculine. You know, I used to switch it up a lot, but for the most part, I used to dress masculine. So that was already a like, whoo, wait. Everybody's like, oh, sweet. Is this the same girl? Yes, it is, it's me. It's a little different.